Hello! In this video we will be learning about multiple strategies to use when solving a subtraction problem. So what exactly is subtraction? Subtraction means to take away from another number. When you subtract, your number will always be less than both minuends in the equation. As you determine the number in all, how many are taken away, and how many are left, you are developing an understanding of subtraction. This also helps develop algebraic thinking. This is Susie's subtraction. She will help you remember important subtraction information, such as key words and problem-solving strategies for subtraction. There are many key words to look for when solving subtraction story problems. Words such as minus, less than, take away, and remain let you know that subtraction will be used to solve the story problem. Can you think of any other words that may be used in a subtraction story problem? There are many strategies we use to solve subtraction word problems. This video will explain and go into detail about the various strategies we use in kindergarten. These strategies include counting back, making a model, and using connecting cubes. Here is an anchor chart listing all of the strategies we will be discussing in this video. We will be using manipulatives such as counters and number lines. Discuss with a neighbor which strategies you are already familiar with. The first strategy we will be discussing is counting back. When using this strategy, students may use their fingers or a number line. When using the number line, put the big number in your head and count backwards. The number you land on is the answer to your subtraction problem. When using your fingers, you show the first minuend on your hand and then put down the same number of fingers as your second minuend. The number of fingers you have remaining is your answer. Use your fingers to solve this problem. 5 minus 4 equals Another way to solve subtraction problems is using a model. When creating a model, you may use two-sided color counters or draw your own pictures. The making a model strategy shows you that subtraction means to take away. When drawing a picture, you will draw objects to match the first number in the equation. This is how many you have all together. The second number in the equation is how many you are taking away. To show this number, you will put X's through that many objects in your picture. For example, in the equation 3 minus 2 equals 1, we started with 3 cupcakes. I X two of the cupcakes out to show we are taking those away. The remaining number of cupcakes is my answer. The same process applies to using two-sided color counters. I started with three yellow counters. My problem tells me I am taking two of those counters away. So I turn two counters over onto the red side. This shows I had three in all and took two away, which were my red counters. I have one yellow counter remaining, so the answer to my problem 3 minus 2 is 1. The final subtraction strategy we learn in kindergarten is using connecting cubes to model the equation. When we take apart cube trains, this models decomposing numbers, which shows students the concept of taking away. This helps students see a number is broken into two parts, 
and if they know one part, then they can solve to find the other part to create the whole. In the problem 5 minus 2 equals 3, we have 5 cubes in all. 2 cubes were taken away. These are the blue cubes. The number of cubes remaining, the red cubes, is the answer to our problem. I hope this video helped you understand subtraction strategies a little more. We will keep working on this concept in class, and by the end of the unit, you will be an expert on subtraction. Remember, practice makes perfect, so keep working hard, boys and girls. Thank you for watching!